these measures, the crucial thing to understand about these measures is that they expire on December the 2nd. They come to an end. And we therefore, as a government and uh, indeed as a country, we have a deadline. We have a target. And we must use this time to develop solutions that previously, in the previous lockdown, did not exist. And in addition to the better drugs that we now have and the prospect of the, of the vaccine, uh, we now have a system of mass testing, rapid turnaround testing, that I believe can be of massive and possibly decisive use to us in this country in defeating the virus. And these tests, as, as you may have seen, uh, can establish within minutes whether or not you're infectious. They're easy to use uh, yourself. They're reliable. They're cheap. And we've secured millions already for this country. I, I think we've cornered a large part of the global market, as far as I can uh, understand the, uh, the matter. And we will be making, we've secured tens of millions, I should say, many tens of millions. And we will be able to make tens of millions more. Uh, and this week, we will begin a program of mass testing. And we're beginning, as you, you may have seen, uh, in the great city of Liverpool. And uh, with the help of uh, voluntary organizations, with the help of uh, local authorities in uh, Liverpool, with the help of the, uh, the armed services and others, uh, we'll be rolling out mass testing to, to help people to understand immediately whether they're infectious, and if they are, that they need immediately to self-isolate, because it's been uh, the gap between the test and the result that, alas, has been so difficult and uh, caused so many problems. And, of course, helping those who are negative, who don't, who are, who don't have COVID, who aren't infectious, to go about their normal lives. I, I see light ahead, and I'm absolutely certain uh, that we have better days before us. Uh, we have not only, as I say, the prospect of a vaccine in the early part of next year, and this is the, the verdict of, of the normally not conspicuously optimistic uh, medical and scientific advisors uh, that we have. They think that we'll have a vaccine in the first quarter of, uh, of next year, but more imminently, uh, immediately, we have, uh, as I say, this, uh, this prospect of being able to establish in real time who has the virus and who, has, uh, who is infectious and who isn't, and thereby to stop the spread.